Depersonalization disorder, DPD, also known as depersonalization derealization syndrome, is a mental disorder in which the person has persistent or recurring feelings of depersonalization or derealization. Symptoms can be classified as either depersonalization or derealization disassociative disorders. Depersonalization is described as feeling disconnected or estranged from one's body, thoughts, or emotions. Individuals experiencing depersonalization may report feeling as if they are an outside observer of their own thoughts or their own body, and often report feeling a loss of control over their thoughts or actions. In some cases, individuals may be unable to accept the reflection as their own, or they may have out-of-body experiences. While depersonalization is a sense of detachment from oneself, derealization is described as detachment from one's surroundings. Individuals experiencing derealization may report perceiving the world around them as foggy, dreamlike, surreal, or visually distorted. In addition to these depersonalization, derealization, disassociative disorders, symptoms, the inner turmoil created by the disorder can result in depression, self-harm, low self-esteem, anxiety attacks, panic attacks, phobias, etc. It can also cause a variety of physical symptoms including chest pain, blurry vision, visual snow, nausea, and the sensation of pins and needles in one's arms or legs. Depersonalization, derealization, disassociative disorder is thought to be caused largely by severe traumatic life events including childhood abuse, accidents, natural disasters, war, torture, and bad drug experiences. It is unclear whether genetics play a role. However, there are many neurochemical and hormonal changes in individuals with depersonalization disorder. The disorder is typically associated with cognitive disruptions in early perceptual and attentional processes. Diagnostic criteria for depersonalization derealization disorder includes, among other symptoms, persistent or recurrent feelings of detachment from one's mental or bodily processes or from one's surroundings. A diagnosis is made when the disassociation is persistent and interferes with social and or occupational functions of daily life. However, accurate descriptions of the symptoms are hard to provide due to the subjective nature of depersonalization, derealization, disassociativeness, and person's ambiguous use of language when describing these episodes is difficult to determine. In the DSM-5, it was combined with derealization disorder and renamed to depersonalization, derealization disorder, DDPD. In the DSM-5, it remains classified as a disassociative disorder, while in the ICD-10, it is classified as a depersonalization derealization syndrome. Although the disorder is an alteration in the subjective experience of reality, it is not a form of psychosis, as the person maintains the ability to distinguish between their own internal experiences and the objective reality of the outside world. During episodic and continuous depersonalization, the person can distinguish between reality and fantasy. In other words, their grasp on reality remains stable at all times. While depersonalization, derealization, disassociative disorder was once considered rare, lifetime experiences with the disorder occur in approximately 1-2% to of the general population. The core symptom of depersonalization, derealization disorder, is a subjective experience of unreality in one's sense or self, or detachment from one's surroundings. People who are diagnosed with depersonalization also experience an urge to question and think critically about the nature of reality and existence. Individuals who experience depersonalization can feel divorced from their own personal physicality by sensing their body sensations, feelings, emotions, and behaviors as not belonging to themselves. As such, a recognition of oneself breaks down. Depersonalization can result in very high anxiety levels which can intensify these perceptions even further. Individuals with depersonalization describe feeling disconnected from their own physicality, feeling as if they are not completely occupying their own body, feeling as if their speech or physical movements are out of their control feeling detached from their own thoughts or emotions and experiencing themselves and their lives from a distance. While depersonalization involves detachment from oneself, individuals with, with derealization feel detached from their surroundings, as if the world around them is foggy, dreamlike, or visually distorted. Some people with depersonalization disorder also have visual alterations such as rapid fluctuations in light. While the exact cause of these perceptual changes has not been determined, it is thought that they may be due to previous drug use. These perceptual changes differ from true hallucinatory phenomena as they are closer to being optical distortions or illusions rather than psychotic breaks from reality. Individuals with the disorder commonly describe the feeling as though time is passing them by and they are not in the notion of the present. These experiences, which strike at the core of a person's identity and consciousness, may cause a person to feel uneasy or anxious. 
Factors that deter diminish symptoms are comforting personal interactions, intense physical or emotional stimulation, and relaxation. Distracting oneself by emerging in conversation or watching a movie, for example, may also provide temporary relief. Some other factors are identified as relieving symptoms, severity and diet and exercise. Occasional brief moments of mild personalization can be experienced by many numbers of people in general society. Depersonalization de derealization disorder occurs when these feelings are strong, severe, persistent, or reoccurring, and when these feelings interfere with daily functioning. DSM-4-TR The Diagnostic Criteria Defined in Section 300.6 of the Diagnostic and Statistical Manual of Mental Disorders are as follows. 1. Long-standing or reoccurring feelings of being detached from one's mental processes or body, as if one is observing, as if one is observing them from the outside or in a dream. Number two, reality testing, unimpaired during depersonalization. Number three, depersonalization causes significant difficulties or distress at work or social and other important areas of life functioning. Depersonalization does not only occur while the individual is experiencing another mental disorder and is not associated with substance use or medical illness. Derealiza derealization, experiencing the external world as strange or unreal, microscopic, macroscopic alterations in the perception of the object size or shape. Number three, a sense that other people seem unfamiliar or mechanical. This association is defined as disruption in the usual integrated functions of consciousness, memory, identity, and perception, leading to a fragmentation of the coherence, unity, and continuity of the sense of self. Depersonalization is a particular type of disassociation involving a disrupted integration of self-perceptions with the sense of self, so that individuals experiencing depersonalization are in the desizations or subjective state of feeling as, 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 as strange, detached or disconnected from their own being. Detached or disconnected from their own being. Detached or disconnected from their own being. Detached or disconnected from their own being.